My name is Brian Benedict. I'm the head of diecast design for Hot Wheels and Matchbox. Um, Hot Wheels has been around for 50 years, 51 years now, and um, it's an amazing, iconic brand that is loved around the world. We're going to be running our uh, 164 scale version of the new Jaguar F-Type down this track, through the studio, and all around um, the facility here. Um, Hot Wheels has had a wonderful relationship with Jaguar for many years, um, going on uh, 40 plus years now, I believe. Um, it's, uh, you know, we've, we've done a number of cars, um, a replicated a number of Jaguar cars in 164 scale over the years with um, something like 110 plus different executions of Jaguars uh, in that time. Um, we've always had a very strong partnership and, and it's uh, really exciting to be here as, and uh, partnering on this uh, important launch. You know, we've partnered very, very closely on this. Uh, we've, we've worked together every step of the way uh, with our partners at Jaguar um, and, and preparing for, for today and preparing for the, the launch of our Hot Wheels car. Um, it's been a much more collaborative experience, I think, than, than with other partnerships. And so it's, it's truly been wonderful working with the team here. We work to create um, a very accurate representation of that car in 164th. Um, yeah, you know, we have to do some simplification at that scale, and it's all about uh, selective um, uh, editing and, and, and uh, modifying the forms to work at scale. Um, we've got to uh, uh, pare it down to four parts. Is basically our, our Hot Wheels basic cars are our, our four-part cars. You've got your body, window, interior, and chassis. Um, and then um, we've got to make sure it works on track. And so there's a lot of um, sort of engineering and design that has to take place in order to, um, to create a car that's trackable and, and, and fits all of the, the specific uh, requirements of our uh, 164th die cast cars. So the cars you see here today um, differ from our production die cast in that um, they're actually 3D printed resin models. Um, so, um, in order to support the shoot, we, we pr produced uh, 20 samples um, uh, that are 3D printed, and um, th we've actually added weight to those samples to make them feel um, like a, an actual die-cast car, to have the proper weight and, and, and feel of, of a die-cast, and that will help it uh, run through the track. So, so the cars you see here today will actually perform essentially just like our final production car, but they're not made of die cast and, and ABS plastic like, like you would see in production. Uh, so so there, are, there are some differences there. It's so exciting to actually see the, the new F-Type in person here today uh, for the first time. Yeah, I've been seeing images of it on the screen, um, and I was, I was very excited to, to come here and, and see it in person.